Hi again, guys. So we talked in the first video about the phrasal verb using the verb look. Now let's take a look at turn. So turn on or turn off. Okay, so uh, a synonym, a similar phrasal verb is switch on or switch off. Okay, so what does that mean? Uh, that's when you make a machine or you make the lights work okay etc or other things so for example uh you you arrive in your house and everything is off okay the lights are off and then you tell your friend turn on the lights please okay turn on the lights please so what does that mean that you want the lights to be on to switch on the lights because it's dark okay if it's dark you can't see but when it's on you can see okay uh, or another example in this case you can say um, turn on the TV please okay so you can say turn on the lights or turn on the TV please so what does that mean for example you have no image or sounds on the TV when you turn on you get the control boop, you turn on the TV you can see the image and hear the sound okay so that's the idea and again turn on or switch on and then you have turn off or switch off so that's the opposite so turn on you turn on turn off you stop the image or you stop the lights okay uh, then we have turn out so turn out could be uh, we have other verbs similar verbs to come or to appear okay so imagine you have an event okay you have an event and then you call people to come to the event and then you can say um more here's an example more than a hundred people turned out on my event okay so more than a hundred people turned out on my event so what does that mean that more than a hundred people appeared came went to your event okay so teacher can I say more than a hundred people came uh, to my event that's possible okay but that's the the challenge of the language when you advance in your English you have to try to use different words synonyms expressions or phrasal verbs because you have to use a variation of words okay so that's the challenge here if you say more than a hundred people came uh, to my event that's okay but then if you say more than a hundred people turned out on my events that means you have more knowledge of the language okay uh, and finally turn down okay so here it's when you have fewer or less opportunities okay so now we have the problem with coronavirus okay so um, now we have less opportunities you know or the economy uh, will turn down yeah so because of the oops because of the corona virus the economy will have a turn down okay coronavirus sorry so because of the coronavirus the economy will have a turn down yeah so probably because of this the economy will have a turn down okay there will be less opportunities um well in that case the the economy you know yeah less opportunities that's fine yeah so you won't have as much access to money probably there will be less jobs as well so you know the economy will have a turn down okay so this is the idea of turn down okay so now one more video and then we'll take a look at the verb uh, take and the phrasal verbs using take